everyone, welcome to Mirror Painting 101 by Miralingo. My name is Megan and I'm the art coordinator and your host for this series. Last week, we shared with you guys about the process of painting a mural. In this episode, we will be sharing with you guys about typography murals! Today, we will be painting our tagline one wall at a time to demonstrate how to paint a text-based mural. Before we continue, we have a very special guest with us. Drum roll, please! A freelance photographer and designer, Imran! Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Would you like to introduce yourself? Introduce myself, you see? Alright. Hey, my name is Imran. I'm a freelance photographer and designer. I normally do fashion shoots and lifestyle here and there and a little bit of graphic design. But enough about me, we're going to move on to the mural. So, this is a mural that we'll be going to do today. It says one wall at a time. It's a motto by Mirlingo that they live by because they aim for social change and they aim to leave an impact for every mural they have done at a time. And it's inspired by the Bauhaus movement. Do you know about the Bauhaus movement? No, would you like to explain more about the Bauhaus movement? Hmm, alright, sure. About Bauhaus movement, uh, Bauhaus actually started in the 1900s back in Germany. They mainly focused on modernism and simplicity in their own intricate ways. It also, Bauhaus has also like influenced various artists and designers such as Paul Klee and Kardinsky, and they are actually portrayed in many other forms such as architecture typography, graphic design, poses, and various other forms. Are there any other details that we have to take note for this particular text-based design mural? Oh yeah, so for this mural that we're doing today, we'll be focusing on painting straight lines, curvature, and a mixture of colours. I can show you some techniques and you can get to it. Okay! So recording from just now, in order to make a grey base coat, firstly you need a bowl with a mound of white, and just add a gist of black. So once we have mixed the colour with uh, white and black, we will have like a darker tone of white and that should be good enough to coat the, on the black board. So from the previous conversation, we have talked about the things that we are focusing today. So one thing that we will be doing is uh, Painting straight lines, the curvature, as well as mixing colours, but we have done the mixing colours. So let me get to uh, painting it straight. So when it comes to painting it straight, we have two alternate ways. One, we could actually like use a scotch tape, which is one over here. You can just like put it along the line and we just paint it straight. Or the other way is that if you have a steady hand, you can just like paint it right away. So when it comes to the next two steps, we have to paint a straight line over here. So if you're painting on the left side, and that's going to be your fill, you can put the tip on the right side. So we're going to start with something over here. Alright, let's do this. Just one over here. Put it on the make sure it's straight, align it. So once you paint it over, So from here, as you can see, the tape is on the right side. Right now, all you just have to do is just paint it over. It's okay to cross path because the ink won't leak at all, so it'd be okay. Alright, so once you're done with the fill, what you can do is that you just peel off the tape and you just get that straight line. But if you could see those 
crease that's like leaking a little bit on the outside. You just have to put that base color and just paint it over. Then you get that sharp line. And the other alternative is that if you have a steady hand, you can just like put it over, use your wrist as the pivot and just start painting. Just angle your brush in a way that you can just like start pushing it down. Imran, what are you doing? Adjusting. For what? <coughs> Ta-da! And that's the end of the episode, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys want to find out more about Miralingo or Imran, you can hit up the links below. Don't forget to like, subscribe. If you like it, share it. Bye!